So I get homesick all the time and whenever I get homesick, I just call my mom. I video call her. Yeah, we, we, we video call all the time. Before I came for this, I talked to my mom. But that's how I managed I video call my mom, I talk to my siblings. With that, I'm fine. I just try to be honest with myself. I think that at the moment I'm here to study, so there is no other way. After I'm finished, then I can go and uh, see my family, my friends, and every day I'm, I'm making video calls, chatting with them. It's okay to be sad. Um, culture shock is a thing. Um, you know, you don't really understand how much you, you know, miss your family and friends back home until you're here. Like there's no amount of prep that can prepare you for what that emotionally feels like. What I do once in a while is I travel over to London to see friends for a while, then come back. At least that one will charge my battery for a bit. Then once my battery goes low again, I travel again and come back. I would say that it's um, important to bring some some items that uh, helps you feel like being at home, some pictures of your family, some personal items, because it, it really means a world for you when you have some low moments and then you have your favorite t-shirt or something that just like reminds you of who you are and where you belong and that's really important. Try to meet as many people as possible. It won't be very easy because of the uh, culture shock that happens to you on coming here. It was, to be fair, it was not very easy for me, you know. Being in a new environment, a new system, a new way of life completely, it tends to be a very daunting experience and it will shake you, but then the more you meet new people, the more you get integrated into society. In terms of advice, I just say, just show up. That's my main thing. As long as you start showing up for things, um, you know, practices like for whatever team you might be interested in, or rehearsals for a show maybe, just show up and I promise you things will get better um, and you'll just naturally get to know people and get to know your environment a bit better. It's definitely worth it. But it's also very hard to go abroad and leave your family and friends and uh, your hobbies and you just need to start a new life. However, if you believe and if you just try hard and you don't give up, you can achieve anything you want.